As well as them doing a new starting box for you to play out some games of Age of Sigmar in, which includes the Flesh Eater Courts and the Skaven, which is looking very cool indeed. We've seen them yeah. do this before as well. Also on the fantasy front, they announced they're going to be doing a new supplement for Middle Earth, which will be called Gondor at War, mm-hmm. which allow you to play out scenarios and the stuff uh, based in that kind of like the final movie, so in, well, in the final book, obviously, as well, in Return of the King. But also three new miniatures that look very, very cool indeed. Well, apart from Legolas's paint job, but we'll we'll skip past that. <laughs> but there's Aragorn, Gimli, and Legolas. The three hunters are ready for you to come and pick up from the tabletop very, very soon indeed. And I can't wait. I'm going to pick them up. They look amazing. Okay, I've got I've got a question. Okay, <laughs> firstly, that Legolas paint job. Ouch! It, it does look like he's been hit in the head with a frying pan. <laughs> yeah, that's that's. That's... It's Matt Damon from... <laughs> it's, it's Matt Damon, yeah. Team America. Team America. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, my second question is, um, anybody that buys that Aragon model, how will they be able to tell the difference between that and every other Aragon model that they have? Is that not the same pose that he always strikes? No, because he's running forward this time. Oh, he's right. Been, he's going to be slightly been... leaned. He's only been running forward in one of the pose, and that was his Helm's Deep version. But even then, he wasn't wearing his cloak and all that kind of thing as well. But isn't that him getting off the ship with it the is, Kingdom yes. of the Dead behind him? That's that that's actually been pulled from oh, the film. That's that him is, just running forwards. That that running off the, off the, the boat, yeah. 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 I like the Gimli model. Gim- Gimli looks awesome. Gimli looks hench. Man. Yeah, I, I really like the Gimli model. I will, I will say <laughs> he looks uh, hench. The Legolas, not so, hench. No, not so much. <laughs> not so much on did, the Legolas. Did you so. get through all the movies, Ben, over Christmas? I did get through all the movies. It did take all of New Year's Eve and most of New Year's Day to do it because my girlfriend was very tired. But we still managed to watch all of it. I have, I have number three in the Lord of the Rings trilogy to watch. So I've got the first two down. And then I'm going to move on to The Hobbit. Yeah. Are you watching the extended version, though? Of I'm course. Watching whatever's on Netflix. Yeah, No, no, forget that. <laughs> you need to watch the extended. I don't have time for the extended. No, no, no. The extended versions are the only versions or, that actually make any sense. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I fell so, asleep in the cinema during Return again. of the King. And I woke up. And even though I'd been asleep for a while, I was like, what I miss? Because... This was, this was for the release of the third. You know, we went to the premiere. Oh, you went specifically and, yeah, to see it. And yeah. we had a few beforehand. I woke up and my mate went, no, I haven't missed anything. You've been asleep for like 20 minutes and all they've done is walk. They've been in the swamp forever. <laughs> I was just like, oh, that's okay then. See, the only reason I put it on was because um, I tried watching the Warcraft movie. In fact, oh, I don't. watched all of it. And straight after it put Lord of the Rings on to make myself oh, feel God. better. Oh, so God. I was just like, and this no, movie's on. not and it. You've not even played Warcraft. I, it takes it to a whole other level of terrible oh. when you actually know what's going on. I, 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 I'm going to defend it. No, it's oh, bad. I feel like a Justin here at the moment. <laughs> no, that movie is bad. Um, I'm going to defend it. I thought, I thought it had a lot of potential. It, oh, it has potential. Especially because... <laughs> that doesn't, if I'm potentially good, it doesn't mean I'm good. I, I would love to have seen them do more of it because uh, one of the things that I really liked about that was just how big and epic magic was yeah. in that. You know, one of the problems I have with Lord of the Rings, right, is that you had... Gandalf the Grey and Gandalf the White. Okay, yes. Gandalf the Grey could cast uh, a, 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 a silent fart, and Gandalf the White could do it a slightly noisier no, that fart. That was who to call him the Brown. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that was the <laughs> Brown. Yeah, yeah, but it is. But you know what I mean? Like the magic in the magic in Lord of the Rings was up. Uh, yeah. It really was a bit naff. You know, there, there was like the the. the, the the only spell that I can actually remember from Gandalf is the where he would make everything go dark and rum and go, Do not take me for a fool, little hobbit. You know, it's a, where he starts talking in old black tongue or whatever it's called. You know, where was the big epic spell yeah. slinging and stuff like that? Whereas World of Warcraft did yeah like the magic was massive in that uh, in that movie it re- it had real potential the whole movie was just, it just felt contrived and i like that the orcs oh, was. W- didn't start out as green yeah but... i like that i like the fleshy orcs the fleshy orcs. i liked a fleshy orc but it, but it, it but it introduced characters and they killed them and i'm like i don't care about that character yeah <laughs> that does nothing for me oh you, am i pl- supposed pl- to care at this point plot holes sorry, you could drive uh, you know uh, an 18 wheeler through, you know, there were just so many, just even <laughs> we're digressing slightly here, but you know, <laughs> you're that. there's that massive magical barrier 
between the orcs and the yeah. humans when they're about to get you know killed up and a few humans get trapped including your man who's son yes. Rag ragnar's son so probably either the bonus Spoilers. or something mm -hmm. he's trapped on the other side and you've got him trying to reach there and reach he almost gets there he just can't and then oh knock back and then as it pulls away the wizard is sitting with a griffin right above the the barrier and just flies down to pick the body up and you're going could you not have done that like 30 seconds earlier when my son was still alive you watched me reach through yeah. you, you ignored me and then you're, you're well you fetched his corpse back god bless you for that i suppose yeah, a good wizard will do that well, yeah, yeah well yeah, like, <laughs> yeah gonna, son of a gun it's unfortunate because you know clearly it was built around more movies and stuff yeah i, I got yeah. to the end of it that's never gonna yeah no it's never gonna i quickly googled it went nah yeah. never in a million years <laughs> Well, we're just I've, messing I've, the CGI the exclamation is, marks. I watched people. Lord of the Rings to feel better. Wow. Right. And the point is, <laughs> you need to watch the extended versions to truly <laughs> to appreciate. To feel even more better. <laughs> just, just watch Willow. Willow.